This show is brought to you by patrons such as Tay Lin, Dharma Wheelies, Milkbox, Phone Losers of America, Fancy Pants, MST3 Clay, Gordo, Crispy808, and Mr. Turbois. Thank you to everyone for supporting the show. You can find out more at immoralhole.com. You can find our archives at travelswithmiriam.com. You can find out how to donate to the show or contribute prank ideas at immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. Gordo. Oh, please leave a message oh, after no. the tone. I don't, well, okay. Hello, I'm calling from the toilet machine service. I need to make sure that your toilet machine is operating pro- properly for the Christmas holiday. And if it is, perfect. If not, please give us a call at this number. Thank you. Uh, cheerio. I have a big, big surprise of coal in my stocking. Guys, for low levels. I, I, hello? Go ahead. Hi. You have the airboat? I do. How much you want for it? Where did you see the ad at? Well, I saw it on the toilet stall here in the gas station. Right in Branford. Hello. Please leave a message after Hello. the... Hello. Hello. Uh, yeah. call, call us back. Yeah, just call me quick. He's going to fuck my ass if you don't. We're interested in the product he has for sale. Please hurry. I don't want him to. <laughs> I want him to. Oh, yeah. I sent you something in Hello? your goddamn messages. Hi. Hello? Uh, hey, I got that one, that thing you're selling. I don't understand what you talk about. I said I, I'm looking for that thing you're selling. I still don't understand it, North Are you, what are you still talking about? I said I, I want to buy that thing you're selling. Too bad. Sorry. I don't talk to people that's stupid. Leave your name and number. I'll call you back. Oh. At the uh-huh. tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up please or do. press 1 for more options. To leave a callback number, press 5. You stupid motherfucker. Better we get to my dad's me if he calls you back. Hi, this is Walter. Sorry I missed you. Please leave your oh, name and number Ranger. and I'll Watch get out. back with you as soon as I can. God bless you. Bye. God bless you. Happy, happy Hanukkah, you queers. At the That's tone, please say. record your message. message when you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. How you doing there, big boy? I just called to see how sexy and tight them breeches are tonight. Why don't you give me a call back we talk about it? Merry Christmas Eve, motherfucker. Dragon. Leave your name and number and we'll give you a call back. Uh, uh, At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. I enjoyed it. Hi, I was calling about the free masturbation uh, tools you got for sale with the vent holes. If you could give me a call back, that'd be great. Thanks a lot. Bye. I love you. Mm. Kisses. Oh. Hello? You found, Dave, you find diarrhea? Hello? Yeah. Hello? Did you find yeah. diarrhea? Did you, look, did you look in your pants? No, you're working your diet in pants, you queer bastard. Hey, you look in your pants and you look for a pecker and diarrhea. You look for them both. Yeah, you got you got the diarrhea and your dick's falling off. Hey, you want to you wanna fight me, boy? You want to get beat up by a gay man? Yeah, come on down. And I'll fight you. I'll bend you over and check your prostate with my pinky. Yeah, you're a bunch of bullshit. I am not. I'm 100% American. I voted for the A number one Joseph Biden. God damn you. Yeah, you sound like you're about half Mexican. Or no, I'm half Mexican. I'm the half that got across the border. You call me an American now. 
Yeah. yeah. What yeah. the fuck you got yeah. with Mexicans, man? What yeah, do you tell have them, tell them about the, pil- the pillows and the fucking tacos. You got a fucking yeah. problem with Mexican food or what, bro? Yeah, you're... Oh, you when you come from Mexico, you was a fucking queer when you got here, so you're double queer now. Well, well, you see what happened? Your your wife came to pick me up when I got here, dog, and I fucked her in the back of your truck, man, when you were working. Yeah. That's what happened, yeah. dog. She put a towel on the bed of the troca, and I fucked her like this. Oh, yeah, oh. Yeah, yeah, she got ran. She got ran through. She got ran through by a bunch of Mexicans. Like her name was Home Depot. It was me, Jose, Luis, Gonzalez, Felipe, Guillermo, Fidencio, Ochoa. We all fucked your wife one at a time, man. Yeah, Come yeah, on. And, and, and Feliz and Navidad. They both did too. And your mother. You think you are, mister? Yes, fuck you, Jack. And tell your wife to shut the fuck up too. Hey, put your fucking wife on the phone, doc. We'll tell her something too. We don't give a fuck. Is tell that your woman, mom? Tell the woman she should. Tell the woman she shouldn't try to wear the man pants, Jack. What are you, so she, much of a fucking pussy dog? You got, you can't handle your own battles or what, dog? Uh, she gonna kick your ass. She gonna do what? She gonna lick my ass, oh man. Okay, if she wants to, I don't care. She can do whatever she wants to it. Yeah, she said she's going to take her fist and stick it down your throat where you won't be able to talk no more. Yeah, oh, we love golden showers. She's going to take a piss and put it down our throats? All right. She told right. me you have limp dick. If it wasn't for her, why not for me? Because her doctor knows all about her. Where her system can tolerate what's I, I heard there's a bunch of gays that live, that live in Newberry. There's a bunch of old gays, old pensioner gays. TV. All the time. So uh oh, I think I think he I think he passed I think he passed away. You think his wife's up for dibs now? His fat ass fucking fell asleep because he had too much of a fucking. This was the most action he's got all week. This guy, where he's listening to his stories. I know he can hear us. He's acting like he can't hear us. Yeah, he I'm, wait, I'm waiting on you, and then I get done. I'm gonna call the police. I'm gonna. Uh, I got a buddy that works for the uh, phone company too, and he can trace these calls for me. Oh, hey, yeah? tell him to tell him to trace my asshole. Tell him that. How about that? Tell him to trace my big fat asshole. <laughs> you gonna do it, huh, tough guy? You gonna trace the asshole or what? Yeah, it is pretty much. Hello. Hello. Hello? Hi, I'm interested in the items you have for sale. You're crazy. It is How am I crazy? Hi, this is Wendy. If you would like a call back. Oh, no. And I will get back to you just as soon as I can. Thanks. Have a great day. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hey, uh, Wendy, we just, um, we needed that stuff for Christmas because, you know, it's it's fucking Christmas Eve. Come on, please. You know, Wendy, Wendy's nuts hitting your fucking face. Ah. <laughs> Mexican. Hello. Oh. Oh. Hi. Mm. Oh. Mm. Dad? Dad? Hello? Father? Poppy? Poppy? I think he fell out of his chair. Puppy. We'll call him back. Puppy. Hello? Hola, Dad. papi. Dad. Dad? Papi? Father? What's up? What do you want? Dad, I'm gay. Papi. Dad. I want your dick. Dad, I got this big, this big Mexican bull. 
Thank you so Hi, much. I love you guys. Sorry I'm not available. We'll take your call right now. Oh. You leave your name and number. <laughs> He's Wayne till he dies. Wayne till he dies. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished play recording, play it. I want to leave a message. Or play it with the music. For more options. Hey, it's it's me right here. It's a uh, pinche Dwight, the motherfucker in Alaska, and all the friends were right here having a Christmas. And we're eating tamales, and I want to give you my big taco de pez queso. Putting a little bit of that sour crema right on your lips. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And give you some chocolate, if you know what I'm talking about, man. Mm-hmm. So please, call us back, man. Mm-hmm. We miss you. He's ready to give you some, some leche caliente y también leche de caballero. We love you. Okay, talk to you later. Bye. Store. Oh, there's something. Hello? Hello? Yes. Hey, it, my name is Juan and I'm here with my friends. We're calling people wishing a Merry Christmas. Ask him if he likes how I play the piano, how I touch the keys. This, this Dwight, he's playing the piano right now. Do you like it? It's yeah. fucking getting down, lit. Oh, God damn! <laughs> <laughs> God damn, Dwight! God's got a Christmas attitude at all. <laughs> oh. Listen to that fucking piano, man. Yeah, I was oh, the original yeah. piano man. Fuck Elton John. <laughs> He's a rocket man. <laughs> nah, yeah. <laughs> And then when I come and I play with him, he turns into a red rocket man. Red rocket man. <laughs> you get, you guys get him down. That's what he's trying. Yeah. Can, can you talk to my mom? My mom right here is Betty. Talk to her, please. <laughs> Betty, don't, ta- don't tell her we do prank calls though. Don't tell her. Don't tell her. You want to kiss me under the mistletoe? <laughs> I I won't tell Santa Claus. Mm. Yes. Smooch. Come on, baby. Come on, baby boy. That's that's how we get presents in, when we're poor. That's how we get presents is we get mom to sleep with Santa Claus. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do whatever he wants. I'll do whatever you want to. Big boy. What do you want in your stocking this Christmas? She she riding that cock under the mistletoe. Yeah. Are you okay, man? I'm, I'm just laughing. <laughs> no, he sounds straight. He sounds straight to me. I'm just laughing. Oh, we're gonna have to do something yeah. about that, man. You got, you got, just calling people and just getting them to start laughing to some funny ass shit. It's a holly hey, jolly Christmas. Hey, hey, you you have a good Christmas and just keep calling people and getting them to laugh. Have a good holiday and a happy. I love you. I love you. I love you. Hi. Hello. Hi. Who is it? Hi, I I'm calling from prison. I'm calling from prison to wish you a happy Christmas. Well, thank you very much. You too. Bye. Yeah, it's the whole album <laughs> sick. Hello? 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 Are you there? Oh. Hello? Oh. Oh. Hello? Oh, hello. Oh, <laughs> hello. Oh, oh, oh. Hello. Oh, oh. Hello. Oh. Hello. Oh. Hello. This is JB. I guess my phone is not going to tell me you're calling. So if you leave me a name and number when it lets me know, I'll give you a call back. Thanks a bunch for talking. 
Later now. Yes. Bye. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hi there. Hey, what's, what's up, fool? This is Hector Ramirez, fool. We need some fucking Krispies donations, dog. You need to give us some uh, that money, that Skrilla, that Scratch. Because we want to make some fucking tacos, the caballero, y también, y taco de pesquis, and we're going to feed you, man. We're going to give it to you, dog. First of all, though, you need to talk to my friend, man. He's right here. Let me put this phone on the fucking phone, dog, and you're going to listen. If I don't fucking catch you, if I catch you not listening, dog, you don't even want to fucking know what will happen, dog. Hi there. I need you to call me back. We need more oh, money, man. I didn't want money. Right now, DTV, I really relate to your... Hello? 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 Can you hear me? Yeah, who is it? Can you hear me? Yeah. It's Mimi. I'm calling about, like, the Christmas tubes. The what? The Christmas tubes. Uh, you got the wrong number, lady. The hotel. Or are you? What are you selling? I'm not selling anything. Are you the hotel? What's that? So you got the Harley. You got the Harley stuff. Yeah, I have the Harley stuff. Yeah, I can't understand you, Harley. Okay, I yeah, want to come look at stuff. it. Huh? I want. I want to get it for my son for Christmas. Hello? Yeah. Oh. Oh, hi. I, oh, I thought you. I thought I lost you there. Oh my goodness. But my son, <laughs> my son identifies as a gay biker. Mom. I want to get him swag. Mom, are you gonna get me that guy's Harley stuff? Yeah, if if you're good, you gotta clean your room. No, I don't wanna clean my room, Mom. And you won't get the Harley stuff. Sorry, are you there? I'll I'll hit you for Christmas. No. Santa's uh, Santa's gonna have a word with you. Hello. Hey, sweetheart. Hello. Hey, uh, we're over here having Christmas. We're here. We're here having Christmas, and we wanted to buy what you're what you're selling. Everybody in. Hello, Come on. This let's Pat or Bingo. 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 You. Bingo. You. Bingo. You. Bingo. 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 Okay, so... Hey, um, we're having Christmas early, and um, I want to know if we can get a Christmas cheer from you. Who is this? My name is Guillermo Ochoa, and... um. We have the Christmas music and my wife right here, Bappy. Hello. I don't understand who you're calling. You. Yeah, but what do you want from me? We need you to tell us Merry Christmas, please. You need me to tell you Merry Christmas? Well, I need you to tell my wife. She's very neglected on Christmas. Her family left her, and I'm the only one she got. And she needs everyone, as many people, to tell her Christmas. How do I know you? Santa Claus. Santa Claus forgot me. Can you pretend to be Santa for a minute? Can you pretend? How do I know you? Christmas Christmas pony. I don't know you. Can you you. please just pretend pretend to be Santa for a minute, please? No, I don't understand why you're calling me. I'm an old man, and it's 11 people. o'clock at night. This is That's not perfect. the time to call me. Come on, man. Please. I need you what? to do this for me. Come you on. No. I don't, no, someone I, I don't know who Santa. you are. 
I don't know who We're you Santa are. Santa Claus. That's I ain't moving. Who That's are you? You don't have to know who we are. My name is my name is Bappy. I'm the wife. Let me tell you, I'm calling the police. I'm calling the police. No. They'll tell you Merry Christmas. No. They'll tell no. you Merry Christmas. No. I'm calling You're the cops no, right please. now. I'm giving them your no. phone number. Please. Please. No, please. No, the cops are coming man. to you. You're no. Oh, yeah. Hello. Hi. Can you, can I, can I, you believe it, I believe in the Constitution. Do you? I think you you should take your tongue and stick it up my asshole. How about that? Oh. Hi, you got Hello? the items? Let me put my brother on because I have to urinate really badly. Hello. Uh, hello. We don't have any we don't have any running water. He has to go outside and poop and piss with the possums. That's kind of nice. We have a we, we no, we have an opossum problem outside. So he goes outside to urinate. He read on TikTok that that's how you get rid of them. You have to mark your territory with your man piss. So you had things for sales? What are you looking for? Uh, really, I buy. I have an addiction to buying things. So really, I'll buy anything you got. Well, I don't know what that means. You have to. What do you have for sale? What are you listing? What do you got? Did, did you look on Tradio website? Yeah, I was on Tradio, but it's not working. It's only loading half the things right now. It just showed your phone number, so I'm a calling. I have a couple comforters in the shipping truck. Okay, are they brand new comforters or are they used? They're used. They're taking good care okay, of Okay, how, how 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 big a bed do they fit? I think one is a heavy-duty king size. The other one's a lighter one, but the bigger one is gray, and it's in really good shape. That fits the bigger bed. All right, uh, and what are you asking? Many, how much? How much for? How much for? How much for both? If you, do I get a deal if I could do both, or are they two separate prices? No, if you do both, I probably do sixty, and that's fair. Okay. Uh, are they? Do you know if they're comfortable? Are they very comfortable? Or yeah, like in your I've opinion, got, I'm not asking you to try them out. No, I've got one big one I don't use on my bed. I have another small one, and I have another one I use, and then I have a wool blanket. Yeah, they're definitely right. warm and they're really comfortable. Oh, okay. They're not. They're definitely right, nice. Well, and they take really well, good care. Right now, I'm right now I'm lotioning my feet with Dr. Teal's foot cream. It's a pure essence salt moisturizer and softening. So I don't have time to time to fuck around. So like, what what's your final dime on these things? I ain't got time well, to fuck around. I'm lotioning my feet. I'm lotioning my feet, man. I don't know what to tell you. you, you I put essence salts all, all over my foot. Yeah, well, I put a Sudafil cream on my legs because it's so dry here. Yeah, I yeah I'm trying. I'm making them supple. I'm making them real soft and supple. Well, it's dry here. We're in a desert winter. Yeah, well, I give people foot jobs, so I got to take care of my feet. Well, that sounds nice. I give rub and tugs with my toes and my feet. They're my money makers, so I take care of them. I, I go and get pedicures weekly. Uh, I get the cuticles, the little nails. I get those taken care of. Well, that works out good. Anyway, you make a box, it's expensive now. Yeah. Yeah. You ever fuck on them comfortables or what? No. They're not. They've never had any dirty, funny play on them at all. What What about any dirty Puerto Ricans? You ever had any guests over that were dirty Puerto Ricans? <laughs> there's not very many Puerto Ricans in class. Yeah, well, there's this one long-legged, pissed-off Puerto Rican who stole my comforter last time he stayed over here, and so I'm trying to find a replacement. <laughs> I don't know. No one's been doing any funny shit on any of my stuff. All right. Do you know any long-legged, pissed-off Puerto Ricans? No, I got. You got to make up your mind. I got to get going. You have you ever had a comforter stolen by a long-legged, pissed-off Puerto Rican? No, I I don't think I would 
let anybody in here unless I knew them very well because I'm very well protected. So what you're saying is you're against the illegals coming over the border. All right, all right, I see what you're saying. No, I'm on. not yeah, saying right. that at all. You just said that. I have no problem. No, with no, anything. no, that's what, like, you you're know, I use the code with you. I I use the code with you, and you agree. No, code at all. I don't. No, no, no I use the code, man. I use the You said, I told you I don't let anybody in my house. I don't give a I use the truth. No, I use the truth social code. I'm I use no. Listen, you're not gonna. Know. You're not get. Listen, bro. I know what group you're with. Like, I'm part of the same group. You ain't gotta fuck around. Like, I I know about the code of the comforters. And I know I know about the long legged pissed off Puerto Rican stealing the comforters. I know all the codes. <laughs> wow, you heard from smoking some really good shit. N yeah, no. Listen. So the meeting is still on. <laughs> Show me the fucking money. And no code. No, no, the money. Hang on, I'm looking up the. I'm looking up the cipher. What does "show me the money" mean? Hang on, hang on. Uh, show me the money. That's from uh, Tom. So we're, so, we're, so we're gonna build. So so you're you're gonna you're gonna meet me over at the come fort then. I don't know any come forts. I gotta go. You're you're wasting my time. Okay, Tiny. okay. Listen, 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 listen. Uh, the, the, the ten tons. The ten tons of goji berries are a go. They're a go. Well. Hello? Hello? Listen, I'm not sucking your dick for minimum wage ever again. You're going to have to bring the wages up. I ain't oh, doing oh, it, man. Oh, oh, oh. I ain't made out of money. Oh. Hello? Yeah, well, I'm not made out of slave labor either. Oh. Hello. Um, we just want to get your package. We're supposed to what? come pick it up. What package? We were supposed to come pick up your package. You had a package we needed to pick up, ma'am. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Hi, uh, did our package get delivered to your house today? Uh, yes. All right. Well, you know, good. I come by now. Let me put my brother on because my hearing's not so good. Hello? I'm sorry. How can I help you guys? Hello? Um, what happened is my brother, he's deaf. He's dumb, deaf, and blind. And, um... He ordered a package to your house because he didn't want his girlfriend to find it. We're just wondering if you got it. Thanks for calling the Comfort Inn. Hi, how can I install the tree in my room? A tree? Yeah. Uh, uh is there not an outlet nearby? Oh no, it's a it's a wood tree. I just I need to bring it in the room. I is it alright if I do that? How big is it? Well right now it is standing Ooh, twelve feet it. tall. It's about eight inches. This is my son. Um I'm not sh I don't I don't think it would mm, I don't think so. Well, should I eat him? Can we rub? Maybe if we put grease on it and we roll, rub it in. Eight inch dickmas tree. It's a very dry pine tree. Um, I would just say no, just just in case. But yeah, I don't think so. That would be. Can we please right. put the Christmas tree inside your room? Uh huh. Let's turn the radio up. Yeah. California Club, this is Luella. Hi, yes? Go oh, fuck me. Go fuck yourself. Default, default has all the goddamn numbers. I, I like, I like this. Thank you for calling the Rose Face Tour in Santa Maria. This is Marissa. How can I help you?
Yeah, we're going to go ahead and bring a tree inside the room. Is that okay? We got the tree over at the Lompoc, um, the, the Lompoc swap meet. A tree? Yeah, we, we got it at the Lompoc swap meet. We won it in a raffle. Me mm-hmm. and Bappy. What so, you want? Uh, mm-hmm. We came out here we to go in the dunes. A tree. No. Oh. You know the dunes? You know the dunes? Yeah. Have you ever have you ever uh, went out on an ATV on the dunes over there? No, I haven't. You are you from here? I'm not from here, and I come yes, here all the I time. Am. And I. I am. I just don't have a truck or anything like that. And I, uh, I don't have a truck, and renting the ATVs are expensive. My see, I get my tattoos done over there, right by the uh, the carnicería. There's a guy he tattoos outside of the back of an abandoned uh, semi truck, and I got all these kind of <laughs> tattoos. He charged me fifty bucks. He does it with oh, a needle and a nice. pen. <clears throat> it's over there. Um, hello. Yes, I'm here. You you know where the strawberry festival happens by the fairgrounds? Mm-hmm. <laughs> he he does it outside of the back of a pickup. Or not a pickup, a semi truck. You ever go to the Strawberry okay. Festival? I do. Oh wow! How come I never see you there? I sell strawberries. I'm not sure. Um, I do have to I go get, now. I make a it's nice talking to you. I, I We're going to be open until 2 a.m. if you want to come. Bye. All right. We'll talk. <clears throat> Thank you for calling Best have. Western. Hello? No, Hello? That's, yeah, that's when it went in. Hello? Uh, hi. You guys We're got pillows? Tr- We're trying to put the tree up, but the 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 outlets are too far apart. Hey, you guys have pillows? You must pilos? have the wrong number. No, no. Why you don't? Hey, don't. Gun club. Hello, bitch. Hello, we're gonna be coming through doing like the the, the Christmas thing. Uh, what? For Christmas, sir, we're gonna be coming through the whole lot of us, and we're gonna be you know getting together. And I just wanted to see if, like, you know, we're going to be able to access the Christmas tubes. You're talking about pistol range? No! Christmas! Like, like Santa? We're, we're closed on Christmas. But we're going to still be in the area, and we're going to celebrate once you guys are back open again for Boxing Day. Ah! Bloody bastard. Gun club. Yeah, you fucking jerk. We want to come in for Christmas. Like my like the wife said. Yeah. We're, we're closed. We want to come. Hey, hey, shut the. We pay dues there, motherfucker. We want to come in and assert our civil rights. Yeah, well, you can come some other day. We're closed for Christmas. No, no, you're going to be in there for Christmas and wearing a fucking Santa outfit and a beard, goddamn you. <laughs> yeah, okay, come on in. And you know what'll happen? You know what you'll what'll happen if you don't? Uh, my nothing. wife's going to sit my wife's going to sit her fat ass on your face. Yeah. I got a big ass. All right, come on she, in. She's got a big ass, and she's not afraid to use it. Yeah. Have her she come has on a in. permit for it, too. Yeah, yeah come here on. it come. I'm come coming. on in. Come on. Come on. <laughs> All right, we'll see you then. Tell your boyfriend to be quiet. Who? Your boyfriend, Mr. Chuckles back there. Tell him to shut up. 
There he goes again. He, he doesn't do what I tell him. Tell his fat ass to suck my ass. Yeah, I don't think he's going to do that either. All right, have a good night. He might. No! Beardos. Your fucking name due to copyright infringement. <laughs> Thank you for calling library. How can I help you? <laughs> Yo. Why you why you talk so fast? Why why you talk? Because so you're ta- you're talking to someone else while you're talking to me. Thank you for calling the library. How can I help you? That's Lord. That guy What's needs up, to get son? his pecker straight before he talks to me like that. What's up, fucking okay. Sancho Claus? What's up? What's up, fuck Sancho you Claus? You talk to my homie? brother that way or what? Yeah, I do. What's I do. Up, I do. What's good? How high are your socks, fool? How high are your socks? Sock check, fool. How are you? Tell me your fucking socks right now. <laughs> Send me a What's picture up, of you. I got you, huh? You got your fucking ink? You got your yep. fucking ankle socks on, fool, huh? What's up? Uh, you're a fag. Shit. Phone banger, fucking faggot ass motherfucker, phone bang. You're a pussy ass. Only f- pussies phone bang. <laughs> He's like, you're gonna sock check me? You're gonna sock check me, fool? <laughs> oh, you got some ankle socks on, motherfucker. Like, yeah, I love it. Sock check in real time. What's up? Send me an issue if I can help you. Hey, what's up, fool? How high are your socks, dog? Uh, pretty high. They better be high, fool. I better not catch you wearing no ankle socks, dog. This is fucking Sancho Claus, fool. I'll put you on the naughty list, dog. What's up? Oh, oh my bad. Yeah, the no ankle socks here. There better not be any fucking ankle socks, and I'm coming in there checking everybody's socks, fool, so you better go fucking tell them to change them right now, dog. I ain't even fucking oh, playing with you no more. <laughs> will do. Fucking all right. Get to it, fool. Get to it right now, dog. Get your fucking ass over there, dog. Get your fucking ass over there, dog. Will do, sir. Go on, get, motherfucker. Come on. Get the fucking ass over there. Go where? Get the fucking socks on, dog. My socks are on. You better not fucking have no ankle socks. I'll come fucking get you with a chancla, fool. Uh, No, no ankle socks here, sir. Let me fucking talk to your manager, fool. I don't like your fucking attitude, dog. Uh, manager's not in. Put whoever the fuck your boss is right now on the phone, right now, fool, because I'm fucking tired of your ass, dog. <laughs> uh, there's no manager here right now. You better fucking put somebody else on the phone, dog. I ain't even fucking playing with you, dog. Manager it's only me in the front. Suck. I swear to God, fool, I'm going to give you to the count of three, fool. Mm-hmm. <laughs> One. Mm-hmm. A two. Two. Oh, here, fool. I'm putting my fucking brother on, fool, because I don't even want to fucking play anymore, dog. Okay. Hello? I'm gonna buy that for you, man. Hello? Hi. Yeah, my that's my that's my nephew. He he's he used to be a CEO over at Nike until he got bounced out, and now he's really self conscious because he works for Reebok. Oh, okay, okay. And so, like, he he really he wants to make sure nobody's fucking around, you know, with them small socks. Uh huh. And and so like then he because he's like, man, they wear the small socks when they sink into the ground, they're they're not gonna be able to get out. That's what he says. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. No. So that's no, why no he do it. Here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So how long no ankle socks? How long that works? Uh, I'm not too sure until, you know, the other socks don't work. Okay, but how long are these socks going to work and then they not work? I'm sorry? How long do the ankle socks work and then not work? Uh, that I'm not too sure. I, uh, I would assume just on the fabric. Okay. Mm-hmm. No, I mean, okay. Mm-hmm. You wear socks with sandals, fool. I bet you wear your fucking socks with sandals. I bet you wear knee highs. You wear knee highs, motherfucker, don't you? Those are the new, those are the new Asian those are the new Asian socks called knee highs. You wear knee high, knee high. Don't fuck with me. Admit it. I don't. 
Oh, you lying. You lying. I can tell. I can hear in your voice. I, 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 I got a lie detector hearing. You lying. You wear knee highs with your sandals. I don't own any Sock sandals. Sock check, motherfucker. Sock check, motherfucker. <clears throat> Please. Have Merry night. Christmas. Please talk to me. I love you. Have a good night. I love you. Kiss <laughs> <laughs> me. Sock team. Thank you for calling the Crown Plaza of Hickory, where your success matters. Ah! For sale, please ah! press 1. For reservations, press 2. For the general manager, did he say welcome three. to the rest no, or to the whole? Oh, well, you're. I can't hear what the numbers he, are. So. No, no, he said he said you thank you for calling. Blah blah blah. Where your socks matter. What he said. Guest services. Yeah, hi. I I I was just listening to the machine. The guy that was talking. Why did he say that my socks matter when the machine? When I was just trying to call in and try to make the reservation. He said your success matters. Yeah, it says socks, but it says socks. Okay. I didn't realize. Yeah. Hey, I just wanted to let you know that, that I, I I recognize the, uh, the, the stress you're under right now. Okay. I, I hear the, I hear the, I, I, why, then why do you have the sleep apnea behind your breath right now? Sleep apnea. Yeah, are you a big girl? Why? Well, how big a girl are you? Uh, did you need help with a room? Yeah, but I don't want I don't want to cause you any undue health risks by helping me. Like, is there somebody more fit and in shape that could possibly take the phone from you? There's nobody here but me. Okay. What well, can you sign a waiver that says I'm not liable if if you have any type of uh, health emergencies while we're on the phone and you're assisting me? What can I assist you with? I need somebody to come up and help me run the extension cords for my tree. Come up. Yeah, in the room. I have the tree, and I'm trying to put the angel on top. But the, I, I have to have the cord. Somebody's got to assist me. Well, I don't have anyone here to assist you right now but me. Okay. Because I went out and I picked out the, the biggest, driest, greenest tree that there is. And I'm, it's in my room and I've got just, I got three pounds of tinsel on it. And it's time to light this motherfucker up. Okay. Oh, I got some nice LEDs. And I got some BBCs. I got some double A's. I got some nine volts. I've got them all. I got candles. I went to Bath and Body Works and got some candles. Okay. They're scented like pine because because this tree's fucking dead. Well, you have a good night. I'm drunk, bitch. Eggnog. Obviously. Hey, hey, ah, that was a jab at me. I didn't like it. Take it back. <laughs> Have a good night. What do you think this is? I, ca- I, I called you obese, and then you call me a drunk. What, this isn't a back and forth. <laughs> That's the way I play. Okay, all right. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come down. and I'm gonna whap you on the on the hand with a flip flop. <laughs> no. <laughs> Okay, all right. I'll stay in my room. I'll stay in my room. Have a good night. All right. I'm going to drink more eggnog and then make mashed potatoes with it. Bye. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Thank you, mac and cheese with eggnog. Cat, you want to sleep in? With an alcoholic or just... Two? Do, uh. do something to honor Carlito, please. Do something to honor Carlito. I'm not good at that. Why you, you got it. Stuck in an elevator call. Gordo. Maybe. Yeah. No one stay on. Gordo, get it. Happy. Anybody can.
I don't know how to honor him. I can't. Someone that. honor Carlito, please. Thank you for calling the sleep oh, in and Hickory. How may I help you? Hi, listen, Hello? we were just playing with the Ouija board. Yeah, hi. We were just playing with the Ouija board up here in our room, and something just went terribly wrong. Okay, well, stop playing with the Ouija board. Well, we've attempted to, and we tried to burn it, and now things are moving in the room. Okay, okay well, what room are you in? Uh, we're in 215 currently. Uh, it's the one with all the lights flickering on and fucking off randomly right now. Okay, well... What's your name? My name's Dwight, and don't take that fucking tone with me. I already had a goddamn demon call me an asshole on this Ouija board. I don't need your attitude also. Get the audience to sleep, too. Very good. Unless it's, unless it's Hillick and the yeah, Hillick just sits there good. falling asleep and going, Computer! <laughs> Computer, I don't trust you anymore. Where the hell Thank you for the calling Baymont in. How may I help you? Hi. Hi. This 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 comforter that you know the comforter in the room. Yes. It assaulted me. There's nothing I can do about that. But no, it's it's too rough on me. It's leaving marks. Well, what do you want me to do? Do you have a replacement? Uh, no, I do not. Okay, so you don't have one here? Like, you don't have anything that would be in-house that would be a little more comfortable? No, we do not. That's all we have. Okay, can you go home on break and bring me one of yours? Nope. Why not? Do you not have anything comfortable? I don't have any comforters. Why not? Are you are you a, not them. a married woman? <clears throat> you don't use what? You don't Please use. rate your satisfaction with our service on a scale. Hey, man, super eight. Hi there, me and my brother here. We've been drinking with our tree all night. We're just trying to figure out how to get in the room. Do what? We want to bring our tree buddy in the room with us. A tree? I'm going to get the chainsaw. Maybe we can trim this door and make the door bigger. We're going to make the door bigger to fit our tree in the room. What room are you in? Well, I'm in the bathroom right now. My brother's in the, in the room. Here, you take the phone. i got to take a shit. Oh, oh ma'am? In. I'm I am in the room with the bed. He's in the bathroom. And you can't get in there? No, we're trying like half of the room is being taken up by the tree. We're gonna have to trim the door. We're gonna have to use the chainsaw to open the door up more. What room is it? It's a, a two fifteen. You'll hear it. We're gonna get the chainsaw out. We're gonna widen this door. Mm-hmm. What room is it? Mm-hmm. 2.15. All right. I'll send somebody over there. All right. We're, 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 no, we're, we don't need the maid. I'm just saying there's going to be noise because we're going to widen this door by three feet. What? What's the name? What do you mean the name? Whose name is the room what? in? Uh, well, it's in my brother's name, but, I mean, officially the one that gave him birth was Jesus Christ of Nazareth. What is his name? Je- you talking about Jesus' name or my brother's name? What is your name? My name is Dwight. Who? What? What is your name? My name is Dwight. Is the room in your name? My name, yes. What is your name? My name is Dwight. And you're in Christmas and it just Eve? Turned, yeah, and it just turned Christmas Eve, so now I'm horny. Oh, yeah. We're trying to pull the tree in. We're, 
Yeah, we're trying to pull the tree inside. It is very difficult. We got a team of men. We got a Clydesdale horse of a man in here. Oh. Yeah. Hold on. Oh. All right. Hey, Mom. Huh? Hey. Hey. You got it. You sound like a hick. Do one. You sound like a hick, and I need a. I need a help. A final. What room are you in? Oh, hello. We're, it, yeah, he's in the shitter. He was in the shitter. I got a shit now. We're taking turns. We're playing battle. Sleep with Morgan. Oh my oh. God! Why would you say that as soon as you answer the phone? It's my job. To say the know. N word. Can I help you? Yeah. Why would you say the N word as soon as you picked up the phone? I said sleep in the mortgage. No, no, no. Don't try to change the story. Don't even try to change the story now, motherfucker. Is this recorded? Nice, strong sounding line. Bam up, I wind him. Hello? Hello? Hi, uh, we, we need people to come, to come to the room. To come to the room. But we need... What, what, what room? What's going on? Well, the door is not wide enough to fit my brother-in-law. He's like, he's really fat. He's got a big belly on him. Okay, so you they got me rubbed. The they got me rubbed. They can rub me with butter, and I can't get through the door. Okay. So, are you looking for they, another they entry? Grease, they grease. They grease my folds, and I can't get in. Okay, so I'm not understanding what you want me to do. I need you to come up here and tug on me. Uh, I really don't feel comfortable doing that, man. So I wish you the best of luck. I need you to come. Room, okay? Hey, no, come tug on my fold. <laughs> I can't do that, man. Come on, man. We're filming an episode of My 600 Pound Life tomorrow, and I can't fucking live like this. Come on, man. Okay. You have someone there to Dr. help you? Now's coming to, doc, yo, Dr. Now's coming to see me in the office, and he's going to ask how my fat ass is doing. I'm going to tell him not good. Okay. Yeah. What room are you in? I'm in between rooms. So I thought I've explained this already. Okay, but what room are you going to? Two fifteen. Okay, and what room are you coming from? I'm coming from the car room. I was in the car. Okay, no one's checked into room two fifteen. What's your name? My name is Dwight, and I have a belly. Okay, what's your last name? McClanahan. All right, I don't even see you here at the hotel, so. So what? Why? What? What happens now? I mean, I don't know what to tell you, man. Like, <laughs> come up here and I talk really to my fool. I don't. I don't know how many times I gotta make this request, you motherfucker. Thanks for call, calling Quality In. My name is Akil. Hello, do you have Hi, a spork? Let Sorry? My, let me put my lover on. Uh, Akeem? I need to connect Hello. to... Uh, the front desk, please. Sorry, sir, I am... Uh, your voice is not clear. Front desk, please? Yeah, I'm front desk. Yes, can you help? Yes, sir. How can I help you? What do you need, sir? Um, well, uh, my husband and I are staying in the hotel. Okay. Okay, my husband is blind. We came in with our seeing eye dog. You may have seen us earlier. Oh. 
Um, okay, and let me step out of the room here for a second. So what can I do for you, sir, exactly? Okay, so what's, what's going on is the, the seeing eye dog died, okay? And I was trying, you know how the windows only open a little bit? Sorry, sir, the windows? You know how you know how the the windows barely open at all. I pushed the dog out the window because I didn't want my husband to know that his seeing eye dog had died, but it got stuck and now it's hanging by the leash out the side of the building. All right now, sir. It's already dead. What the dog? The dog's dead. Yeah. Oh, sorry to hear. Can, sir. Can 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 you act like the dog so my my husband doesn't know it's dead? Can you bark into the phone, please? One second, let me go get him. Honey, hello. I'm gonna hello. I'm gonna take the dog for a walk, okay? Oh yeah, oh, Hakeem. Okay. Go ahead, go ahead, bark. Hakeem, bark. Hakeem. All right. Why is he not barking? You're not helpful. What's going on? I don't on? know. But he doesn't understand. He heard dead dog, and that's all he heard. Sir, currently you are in which room, sir? Room number? No, the dog's not in the room. It's hanging out the window. Because they tried to throw its corpse out the window. So you are saying that the dog it's has been hit from the window, and it has been died. Yes, I yeeted it out the window after it died. Not before, after it died. It was already dead. Already dead. But now okay. it's just hanging there, stuck on the side of the building. Okay, sir, then... Uh, wow. Can we get a new room? Sorry? Can we get a new room? Sir, uh, currently are you in... Uh, uh, I... Sir, I want to come near you, sir. Uh, you are in which room? The room number? You want to come near me? The, yes, the, ro the room has, like, a wet dog smell. I think it's because, like, when it died, it it um, went to the bathroom. Okay, okay, sir. Uh, I can see you coming on the floor, too, right? Are you the one? Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Let let me talk with you, sir. You are coming, right? Can you are you gonna come up to the room? Sorry. Are you coming up? Yeah, sir. I'm coming up. Uh, in which room are you, sir? Room number. I mean, I don't know. It sounds like I'm gonna be in trouble. Like, I don't. I don't really want to tell you now. Uh, sir, sir. Sorry to say you that. What exactly I need to I need to do, sir. Um, well, I asked you to bark into the phone and you wouldn't do that. Sorry? I asked you to bark into the phone and you wouldn't do that. I need to, but... Husband? Yeah, Husband? can you stay in which room, sir, so I that know. I can directly I, I, come and talk to I, you? I, Hakeem is just too much for me. Oh, okay. Sorry. Can you talk to him? Yes. Hello. Hi, yeah, ma'am. Oh, yes, I'm a ma'am now. Yes, hello. Huh, hello. Hi, so our doggy, he's a ghost, and he's haunting us in the room. Okay. Do you have a way to make him to stop because he is in the window, and he is making us scared, and he, he's the ghost of Christmas future, apparently? And we've we've oh. been uh, cost costing company money and and driving people nuts and with their jobs we're dri we're squeezing them all the money and life out of them and we're paying them very little. And so Ma'am, cu currently you are in which room? Ma I'm sorry. Edward. I'm sorry to interrupt you. Uh, you are in which room, yeah. ma'am, so that I can come to you? The, the room number. Oh, I don't know. I can't see. You please uh, tell out the room number, ma'am, so that I can help you out. 
Well, I'm in the room that has the the beeping sound. It keeps going beep, 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 and I can't see a thing, so I don't know. Like you put me here, you rolled me in. To can the front you please door. Uh, can you please check out on the key on which room number, ma'am, so that uh, I can come and address you. You're gonna address me. Yeah, I uh, I, I wanna come and talk to you, ma'am. You please check on I'm the key. I'm blind. Which room? Do I'm undressed right now and I'm blind. You're going to come here and dress me? I'm saying I that I'm going... Yeah, yeah, look at the key, ma'am. Oh. Or I you can blind. say your name, ma'am, so that I can check from here. Sir, I am blind, and I am a sir. I don't know why you think I'm a woman. Okay. You know, you're, the ADA is going to hear about this. The Royal ma'am, Service sorry. is going to hear about this, too. I can't see. Oh my you gosh! Me, look, I can't Sweet see. Can you, I'm so can you confirm the name, ma'am? I, I can't come. I'm, I'm a man. I can't come right now. I'm busy. The dog Hakeem. is wearing a business suit and is no. haunting us. No, I tried pulling it up from the window, and it, I, it got caught on something, and I pulled extra hard, and just the head came up with the leash. Sir, the, the room is in uh, the room is in it's which name, sir? There's half a dog down there. There's, our dog is having trouble getting up. Can you please tell us how to make him come up? He's a ghost. I'm the dog. Very lost. Yes, the dog. He's a very yes, nice dog. Would you like to meet him? Wait, wait, wait. There's a man walking by the room. Sir, excuse me, sir. Hi. How can I help you? Honey, do you want to tell him? I think it's the best coming from you. Is it? Is this the old blind bitch that's been making all the noise? I'm a man, sir. I'm a man. Nah, not with that. Not with that haircut. You have my dog. Half of it, yes. Which half? I have the hole. I have the the end with the hole. Is it an immoral hole? Yeah, and there's juice. There's juice everywhere. What kind of juice? Are you drinking the juice? Yeah, sir. Did did the did the dog piss your pants as well? No, it, that pee was from before. We just let him go in the room because we weren't really, you know, we didn't want to go all the way outside to let him go to the bathroom. Hello, so just, like, sir, and sir, and sir these people have been letting the dog poop and piss and, and Ben chode in the room. Are you outside? Is that you walking out there? Hakeem, is that you? Sorry, sir. I'm not doing. Is, that's not you outside, sir. I want to. Uh, I want to know exactly what I need to do, sir. And I want to know in which room number are you, so that I can come and talk with you. He, uh, sir, they're on. They're in the room. They're in the GB Road room. GB Road room. Yeah, they're in GB Road. Sir, the. So this is quality in, sir. The quality in hotels. Right. You know about GB Road? No, sir. Uh, sir, I am talking uh, from qu- quality in hot motels, sir. Yeah. Are you are you in the quality in hotel, sir? Hotel, sir. Are you staying in this motel? In the Burlington one? Yeah, on G on on GB Road. <laughs> GB Road. Yes. Sir, this is Burlington. Prosti- the, Are you the, prosti- the prostitution road. The prostitution road. Sorry, sir. I don't know anything like that. It is quality in Burlington, sir. No. I'm calling from Terry Chute Road.
Hello. Hi, you sound like you have a dry mouth there. Why don't you wet your whistle, Terry Makichuk? Sir, you cannot talk like that, sir. I can't say what? Can I say Terry Marilan? Sir, you are calling from... I am, I am from Quality in Motors, sir. Yeah. If you want any help, you please let me know, sir. <clears throat> Yeah, but the the problem is, is I need some kuti ma, uh, the kuti uh, mutra and the suru mutra. Sir, I did not get your language, sir. Sorry to say that. Uh, do you do mara mara chod? Sir, you cannot abuse like that, sir. If you abuse, I, I will disconnect the call, sir. Next. Oh, uh, the, uh, let's see here. I'm sorry. Did you get Ben on the phone? Ben Chowd? Yes. Yes, Ben Ben Kilordi. Yes. I have him on phone. Can you ask him to hold the lantern? That was really long. All right, guys. Hello? Hello? Hi, I can, I can hear, hear myself, myself in your, your phone, phone echo. echo. Oh, hello. Maybe it's... Hello? Don't yes. Hello? Hello? Hold on, let me change my... My, my son's got the phone and my fingers in the... In the hello? Hello, ma'am? Yes. Yeah, the, be the bed just sexually assaulted my father. Who? The bed sexually assaulted my father. Who did... The bed, the bed, the bed in, the in the room. Which room? 215. Uh, Goddamn okay. pervert bed in here. Oh, um, this is a different motel. This is uh, Madison Inn motel. We don't have 215 here. Yeah, it's yeah, a 215. 215. Yeah, but I don't have room number, any room number that's 215. Then what room, then what room, is, then what room is this? I don't know. You call Goddamn me. Goddamn pervert so. room. Goddamn, Goddamn pervert, pervert bed, bed in, here. in here. I don't have any old person living in my motel right now. No, no. no, see, no the see the bed. bed the bed. The bed, the bed was like, oh, stay, stay still, stay still. still. And then it inserted into my father. Mm, this is a wrong number, so. You sound, you sound stupid. stupid. You, understand you understand that? You tell me it's a wrong number, wrong hotel. You sound ignorant. I'm not ignorant because I don't have. You sound like a typical woman. woman. With no, no degree. degree you're a housewife, housewife, probably. Costing something north of eight hundred dollars a month to eat. Cobblestone Hey, hi. How do I get Hello? my tree in the room? Hello? Your tree in the room? Yeah, we greased it up a little bit in the plastic, and we're trying to get it through the door, but we're having a little trouble. Like Where are you trying... at? It's not going to work. The fucking branches are too big. No, I'm telling you, it'll fit. Just Where are you at? It up a little bit. Well, we're out here. We're just we're trying to just put it in here. I mean, like, what door are you at? Brother, what door is this? It's it like it's over by the stairs. Like, oh yeah. Like the the stairs are all clogged. Uh, yeah, I we, just walked past the stairs the and branches. I didn't see nobody. Well, we just did this. We we're having trouble here at the door now. Okay, we're trying to get a tree in here. That's what it is. Yeah. You said a tree, yeah, right? Yeah, we got. Yeah, a tell, tree. tell her no. There's no presents if there's no fucking tree. So we're trying to get the well, tree. We got the kids, you know, we got the kids. We gotta get the tree in there. They said they're at one of the doors. What door was it, sir? I ain't really sure. We've been drinking, and we got the tree here. We've been drinking the tree. This one was locked. We had, yeah, we had to pry the door open. This one was locked. We pushed it in with the door, the tree, you know. Now we're putting it in the room. We need a Christmas tree here. We had to hook the we had to hook the door handle up to the truck and pull. It's probably frozen. Just come around front. No, it was locked. 
tree's not frozen. It's nice and warm inside. I'm, I'm talking about the door. Right now, we got in. We got in. It's just we can't we can't get the tree in. I think the door was gay and it didn't want to open up to us. Brother, you need more tree water. Yeah, drink some of this. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, it tastes like maple maple syrup. It's coming out of the tree. We gotta drink it. Oh, it's squirting okay, just like I'll, mom I'll used to back in the day. Yeah, drink that juice. Uh, like dad used to say. Drink that juice, baby. <laughs> that should fix it. But how can I help you? Uh, we're trying to get the tree into the room, but we're trying not to wake people up. We greased it up pretty good in the plastic, but my brother and I have a bit of trouble. Is there any chance we could widen the door frame here with maybe just cut it open a little bit? So we can fit the tree in. What room are you in? Well, I'm I'm outside the room. I don't know what the number is. We 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 I don't know if we pay yet, brother brother, did you pay yet? No, the, it said uh, one guest per room, so we we just let ourselves in. All right, so yeah, we got the tree. We're pushing it in. We're pushing it real, real in, real deep in there. But we need like you got some way to get in there, like some sort of grease. In Hello. 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 Yeah, what room are you in, though? Right, yeah, we're right here with the tree, right outside the front door here. We're oh, yeah, here, here, here. Move, move, don't, don't move it that way. Yeah, I gotta put it this way. God damn it! Oh, shit. How much is that gonna cost us? Probably three dollars. Hello? Thank you for calling Fast Question and Tell. My team is speaking. How can I help you? Hi. My brother Hi. and I are trying to get the tree in the room. We're trying to figure out the logistics of it because we pushed the door open. We got in there and now we got this big old tree we cut down and put it on our truck and we took it off. And we've been we've been drinking with the tree all night. Uh, I'm drinking its waters, as many waters uh, that came out. I'm tell I'm I'm telling you, I watched I watched his show and this this fucking coyote drew he used paint and drew on the side of a mountain and he'd go straight through. We could do that with a tree. Well, that's what we done, boy. We opened the okay. door, we painted the picture on the front of the door. We painted a tunnel we'll on the right wall through with the tree. They say this tree water is not toxic, but I see oh. shit. Sweetheart, do you so know you're called Best Western Hotel? Oh, yeah, we're right here. We're out front of here. We got the tree. We're bringing it in. Sorry if we bring the tree in. That's uh, all we're no, we're not allowed to have trees in the hotel, sweetheart. Well, how can? It? Oh shit. We got a situation. Things are happening here that I wasn't thinking that was going to happen tonight. What room are you in, sweetheart? Now, that's the funny that's the funny thing. I'm blind. I haven't got the key card neither. He's got the key card, but he's he's uh, he's been drinking all night. I I I I am the key master. I am looking for the gatekeeper. Well, you come up and see me and I'll help you find your room. Is Rick Moranis I, I up use, there? Yeah, she's she's the gatekeeper. You sound like a younger Susan Sarandon, if I do say so myself. Nope, I'm good. So mm. just come up to the desk and I'll help you. No. 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 My, would you see my brother? He fell. That's a blind joke because he was he was blind and he fell. The wheels fell off my bus. How are we doing? Are we, are we gonna get the tree in? You better yeah. not get the tree Here, in. Here, we're, we're gonna put the tree through the window. In it goes. Yeah, there it goes. Yeah. See, I told you it'd go in. That's it. I told you it'd go in. 
It went in just fine. Uh, we can put tinsel on it and popcorn. Here, I'm going to put some fireworks on it. Yeah, it's so pretty. I like, I like the lights. I don't like the fireworks. <laughs> Hit that wrong. He's like, hey, I don't know what that has to do with being gay. Hey, listen, um, I don't know how to tell you this, but I'm in my room and I'm butt chugging my neighbor. We're gonna need towels. Um, alrighty. Uh, I can provide you with towel. What room number? Do you want me to bring him down to you? Or? I'm at, well. I'm in two fifteen and he's in two thirteen, and I've just got a mouthful of ass juice. Sounds super. Um, it is. Thanks for asking. <laughs> um, <clears throat> which room would you like me to bring him down to? Uh, why don't you split the difference? Because I'm not paying for it. He was the, he was the one that was like, "Oh, it's Christmas Eve. I bet you can't eat my ass," and I won. Nice. Nice. Uh, these these fucking business trips are just getting out of control. We sell insurance, and we're very <clears throat> competitive. I I would imagine. It sounds like you guys are pretty serious. <laughs> no, like, like we, we started out first, like, me and him, we, we used to sell watches together. We used to sell Cartier watches, and then our business went under, and I referred him to the insurance company we work for now. And so mm-hmm. I, I have more seniority than him, but I also have a bigger tongue. And so right we're on. trying to conceive a child naturally right now. Like we're trying to. I really, I've been watching CNN, and they like. So we're trying to naturally like two men in one child is what we're trying to have. Anything is possible. Because if you think. make if you make you make love you make love with the man enough times, and, and then the semen will find a way. Hmm. Yeah, will find a way to his eggs. I'm not sure how that plumbing works. I was gonna say. I mean, I don't know if he's got a uterus. I don't know. I don't know how that all works. But you know, if there's a will, there's a way. I, I, I pray. I, I I just pray every night that he'll carry our child, and then we'll get that family insurance rate, and then we won't have my like our rates will go down, and then we'll get the whole life coverage, and but we'll get it at a good a good price at a discount. Yeah, full package at a great price. There you go. Yeah. And then we'll, I'll be able to leave my my old, my grandfather's old 1957 uh, Ford truck. It's got a bed on it, and then I'll be able to leave that to him. And maybe he'll tinker with it when he's older. And then uh, I've got this I've got this old uh, shack. It's like a little shack up on the mountain, but the 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 land is worth more than what the shack is. But like if he ever went it went insane, it'd be a good place to hide out. It sounds like it. Well, I'll be right up with uh, these towels, buddy. Okay. Hey. Okay. Oh, yeah. Hello? He's got yep. towels. Hi. He's got towels. Hi, I'm cold. Right on. Fucking well, negative 12 degrees. I'm fucking mm-hmm. cold, you son of a bitch. We supercharged the air co- the air conditioning. We put more Freon in it. My fucking balls have... Icicles hanging off of them. He, we were reenacting the scene from Joe Dirt when the dog's nuts got stuck on the porch, but his nuts are stuck on the air conditioner, and I've got to get a spatula. Yeah. Um, all right, I guys. want to go back to fucking it's, California. Like funny. It's hey, fucking this cold is funny today. and everything, but like, I got to no, get off No, you're not listening now. to me. Why are you No, go? you're not listening to me. I'm telling you what? things, and you're not listening. Hard for, hard I think I've listened know. plenty, guys. I'll be right up there. Goodbye. Thank you. Our Don't friend is freezing and our other friend has ass juice in his mouth. Get yeah. serious. Don't be a homophobe. What an asshole. Police thing. <laughs> That's illegal. Hello? We're doing illegal things with the tree in the room. Hello? Hi, we're doing illegal things with the tree. <laughs> we're trying to make it you know, go in the hole in the door. We want to, we want to put the, sh- the tree in, with shoes on and we we'll drink the water from the tree. The what I was trying to do was I was trying to get sap out of the tree. Yeah. Do you follow? 
Hello? Sir? Yeah, so I had stuffed my dick in the tree and maple syrup didn't come out of my ass like I saw it. Who is this uh, best night in Martin? What is it? Look, I stuck my dick in the tree and maple syrup came out of my ass. So what's so hard about that? Hello, Banchot? Hello? Wrong number, sir. Did it have some bark? No, I don't. Was there some bark on it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I want to... False advertising. I feel like 100,000 is like a bat. Hello? We're flashing our lights in the room and the tree is having a, a fit. It's shaking. Yeah. yeah. What tree? Yeah, the tree. The it's... Christmas tree. We Which installed Christmas a Christmas tree, tree in the room. Oh, I got That's you. That one. Um, yeah, I apologize. Yeah, we I cut mean... down one of the trees. Mm-hmm, yeah. Um, I'm not sure anything about the electricity in the room. That would be more of a maintenance question. They aren't here at the moment. Um, well, I would say most likely try switching it to a different outlet, and it might work out better for you, but otherwise I'm not sure. I'm sorry. There are woodland creatures in the tree, though. What do we do about those? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm sure you guys can handle it. No, I'm afraid of quadrupeds. I need you to come out here and remove them immediately. No, that's okay. Thank you guys, though. I hope you guys have a good night. What if he scratches my beautiful face? Mm-hmm. I'm sure you'll be all right. Have a good night, you guys. You sure I have a beautiful face, or you sure I'll be all right? Thank you for calling Baymont okay. by Wyndham Oakler. This is Hope. How can I help you? Hi. Hi. Um, the lights in our room are too bright. I think they're like 100,000 lumens or something. The lights in your room are too bright? Yeah, it's like we turned them on. <laughs> see, you, see, bless him. You see what happens? You ever like look up at the sun and have to sneeze? Does that ever happen to you? Not to me, no. Well, like look. Oh, yeah. Like well, looking up at the light, my friend just sneezed because the light was so bright. Okay. And the light was so bright that he had to wear shades. <laughs> and, sure. I mean, okay. do you do you guys like do you have like a standard wattage of bulb that you use, or do you just let the handyman do whatever he feels like? He was like, "Oh, I'm going to put a spotlight in this room. I'm going to put the bat symbol in this room. <laughs> I'm going to put, you know, the Levi Stadium lights in this room." You know? Yeah, I don't know. I what would, would you like I would me ask to do? You to come up and have a. Well, see, the problem is, is I can't have you come in and inspect because I don't have any suntan lotion to put on you. Because you might get... <laughs> a sunburn? And. Yeah. yeah. I could just turn off the lights and I'd be in the dark like I am with my life in general. You know. You know, Yeah. <laughs> Why are the lights flashing red and blue? Am I in trouble? It quite possibly. Yeah. I have a friend who has a very powerful light. Very powerful what? Light. It's mm. the light of my life. Awesome. But not in a gay way, in a totally platonic you know, football playing UFC kind of way. Sure, sure, I get that. Not like two guys in a hot tub kind of way. Yeah, he's not <laughs> talking about two guys in a hot tub fucking or nothing like that. Like plutonic is what he's talking about. Yeah, bubonic, plutonic, whatever that is. All right, well, you guys have a great night, okay? Good luck okay. with the light. Yeah, it's a problem. All right, bye. These these wires are all frayed. 
Thank you for calling. How can I help you? Oh, my God, this cocaine is wonderful. Hello? Yeah. Did somebody answer? Hello? I'm here. I broke I broke the mirror for illicit activities. Say what? I broke the mirror in my room for illicit activities. Okay. The you lines the lines weren't gonna they weren't gonna separate themselves. And listen, a line that's not separated can't sniff itself. It doesn't just go up the nostril. Things have mm-hmm. to be put in motion. Okay, so you're calling from the tree? Yes. Well that's my cell phone. I run a tree farm. Oh, okay. And so where exactly? And this is my this is my this is my this is my busy time because of all the Christmas shit that's going on, all these these fucking people that believe in God and Christmas and all that, they come and buy trees from me. Little know they buying a tree from an atheist. Well, Christians don't believe in trees anyhow. Wait, you're an atheist? I'm an atheist. Excuse me, sir, you're an atheist? I I want a refund. This guy's a dickhead. Refund. He's just passing past my room and he's just I want this motherfucker kicked out. Yeah, okay. It was false advertising. You told me G- this was the Jesus tree. That's the same burning bush tree that Jesus was spouting his shit from. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so can I get a discount wh- because it's not a real it's not a real Jesus where, tree? I'll where burn this fucking tree and give you a discount. Hello? Yeah. Okay, so you're obviously not in our hotel. You're just a prank caller. No. I am not. That's a goddamn lie. And you can't no, prove it. No, this is a 100% accurate call. I'm going to I'm gonna take you to, yeah, gonna take you to fucking what? court for a lie. You, you're for liable. You're, you're defaming me. I will take you to court, and you'll have to prove those statements in the court of law. It's going to be like Johnny Depp and Amber Heard all over again. Yeah, but you're not shitting in my bed. You guys are funny. Okay, well, you guys have a great night. Thank you. You didn't make it seem like we're really that that. funny with that that tone. I mean, try again. That what? Oh, you're really funny. Yeah, and you didn't sound sound particularly impressed when you said he worked in a tree lot. Not really. Are you looking for someone a little more successful? Yeah. 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 You sound like a a panini maker that only gets the medium heat and not all the way to high heat so it can be pressed down to make a real sandwich. Yeah, I don't know. You know, if he's... If he's working in the tree lot, he's a seasonal worker, which means he's going to have a lot of time left during the year to, like, you know, take good care of you, draw you a hot bath. I don't know. From from, no. from what I'm picking up, is she's a tree sympathizer is what it is. Oh, my God. You're right. Are you saying the trees are not to be cut down? Yeah, she's, okay. she's saying the trees I'm are people, that, too. I'm thinking that you two must be an item here. Uh, oh, no. Only when we're drinking. I mean, yeah, I see. I knew it. Cold. And it's not, it's, it's not like that. It's totally platonic. Okay. If you say so. Yeah. The little tonic is in a little, a little of that stuff. In a little tonic here. is a lot of play, yeah. huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> We we watch kid and play when we get gay together. Mhm. We, we yeah. watch house party. I like calling him eraser head. Yeah. Yeah, I can imagine. And then we bump into the DJ table, and Martin Lawrence gets pissed. He's like, "Quit hitting the table! You make the fucking record skip." Mm. Mhm. Okay. You're too you're too young to get that reference. Yeah, probably. So. Yeah, probably. Mm-hmm. Okay, you don't know well, who kid okay. and play is. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys, it was fun. <laughs> All right. Well, hang, hang okay. up the phone. Get out of here. Yeah, Merry Christmas. Yeah. Go, yeah. Goodbye. I like to kill. Hey, wait a minute. I just want to let you know on this Merry Christmas Eve, there's a lot of people having sex and fornicating in your hotel. So? We hope <laughs> that adds to your enjoyment of the season. Yeah. Well, it obviously Don't try not to get. Try not to get too horny during your shift tonight. Well, I don't think that would be a problem. You okay, likewise. What sure. does that mean? No, I, there's, no there's there's no hope for that. There's no are hope all the that. guests homely or something? Are you saying that none of the guests that come in are attractive? I never say anything like that. 
So oh. do you buy the hour bookings? Hour hour booking? No. Nope. If you want to do that, I think there's a place downtown you could probably get together with somebody. So I, oh. a lot downtown. What's the name there. of the place? Yeah. Uh, honestly, I don't know. You'll have to Google it. I'm sure you can find it. <laughs> what, what, are, what, you are the search terms? Yeah. what are the search terms? Place downtown where I can get a hookup? Like, how do I Google yeah, this? Yeah, yeah, just go prostitute. Downtown fucking, I think, is what you look for. Yeah, or cheap hotel. There or you go. cheap receptionist who will answer a phone. Who what? Nothing. Okay. I don't even want to talk to you anymore. I don't even know why you're still here. You've outlived your usefulness. How do you get the sex smell out of the rooms when people check out? That's a really uh, good question. Uh, that is a good question. I don't know. You guys should know that stuff. Okay. You have a great evening. I have work. How do you get the stank out of the room? Bye. How do you get that? <laughs> no, I'm in Motel 6. John speaking. How may I help you? Hey, John. Yeah. Something happened in the room. Mm, what room are you talking about? I we're in two, we're in two fifteen, and something happened. Two one five. Yeah, and something happened. Oh, he said two fifteen. Yeah, don't don't spell the room at me, John. I said two fifteen. Come on. So what's going on in the room is um, we we bought a Christmas there tree from a Christmas no tree room lot. Two fifteen. Huh? Maybe what is this written on the little jacket with the key card? Uh, I, I just think it's John, not spelled right. John didn't spell it right. He's 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 dyslexic or something. So anyway, well, we got this funny. tree in the I'm room. Dyslexic. Well, that's why it is funny. You know what that reminds me of? I have a friend named Kat, and I was talking shit about um, Toyota Yaris. I was like, oh, it's a funny car. Uh, and then she's like, oh, actually, we just bought one. And I was like, oh, no, it's a great car. It's totally practical. Did that ever happen to you? Like, not really. Uh, okay, has this in, ever happened What room you? are you in? That's why you'll never amount to jack shit. So I think we're in 125. Because if I move the numbers around, that happens. I don't have anybody so, in 125. Well, you have a tree in there. A tree in one of the rooms. How big is the tree? Yeah, so we put a tr Well, we cut it down in the neighborhood. It didn't look too well, so we're like, okay, no one's going to miss this tree. <laughs> and so we cut it down, and then we we went to Ross, and we bought, like, a bunch of cheap ornaments, and we put it on there. And then all of a sudden, like, we went away, and we came back, and there was, like, a smaller tree next to it. It was like the the tree had given birth. And there was, like, a branch going from one tree to the other. Should I cut the tree umbilical? <laughs> oh, look. Is it ready to be separated from its mother? <laughs> Are you a doctor? Are you a tree doctor? No. You wouldn't flush a baby, would you? Uh. Oh. Little little needles are getting all over the toilet rim. I'm trying to. I'm not gonna get. I don't know. It's not a human, though, so I can do whatever. I don't know. I happen to be using the bathroom while we're talking. I 
I did I did eat at Chipotle and then Taco Bell and then Del Taco and then I did a round of Dunkin' Donuts so I might be stuck on the toilet a while. So what is a Del Taco? Oh, it's a, it's a taco place, you know. It's like a, it's like I don't know. It's like Taco Bell, but not. It's like a ghetto. It's like somewhere between a, a real taqueria and a Taco Bell, something like that. Hmm. Never been to one. You never will with that attitude. <laughs> All right, update. I have an update. There is okay. Something that looks like a cross between a bonobo, an emu, and a sweet potato walking around the room. I have no idea what that would look like. I do. I mean, I know what an emu friend is generating but... pictures. <laughs> what about a Shiba emu? You know, like an emu with like a Shiba inu's head? Have you seen those? No, I haven't. I mean, what would what would be the evolutionary advantage of a bird with a dog's head? Go. I don't know. It depends on how the rest of the anatomy of the creature is. Because if it's the rest of the ma- anatomy is made. Well, what it would be geared towards, because most of the bones for birds are hollow, so they're lighter, so they can fly. I just learned something, actually. I didn't know bird bones were hollow. Continue. (laughs) Makes them light enough to be able to fly. Or at least that's what I've heard. What are you... Do you have a soundboard in your room or something? Congratulations, you got that answer correct. Uh, Are you? Do you like Family Feud, the old, old Family Feud with Richard Dawson, or do you like the new Family Feud? I've seen more of the new stuff than the old one. Uh-oh. The plot thickens. <laughs> we asked 100 people what would they most do in a hotel room with a naked monkey. I think that's the wrong sound effect. You might be right. <laughs> So we've got a single mother tree in the room, and you haven't really addressed that. (laughs) Uh, I think it's time to say Merry Christmas and Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa, Happy all the pagan things. Yeah, Festivus. (laughs) And yes, Festivus. Uh, happy Holidays works, too. And I think that covers all of them. It's kind of lazy, though, when you really could just say them all. Yeah. Well, there's some neither one of us probably know about. Yeah, but those don't, don't count. <laughs> um, but I can call them and let them know. Oh, yeah, that's my entertainment that just arrived at the room. So I think we have to go. Okay. You have a good night. Bye. Bye, baby. I love you. <laughs> Smoke weed every day. Oh, it's the Charlie Brown Christmas. Hello. Hello. A wonderful good day to you, ma'am. Who is this? This is David Goodman. The CEO general manager. Hey, why don't you suck my dick, you sorry motherfucking son of a bitch? Mm-hmm. Hello? 
Hey, wonderful. Good day to you, ma'am. Hello. This is David Goodman, the CEO General Manager. Fuck you. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. How you doing, Dave? Hey, wonderful. Good day to you, ma'am. Good morning. Uh, you did you call me? This is David Goodman, the CEO yeah. General Manager. All right, somebody called me and I hung up the phone. So. Uh huh. So you did you did call, right? Where's your husband? Excuse me. Hello. 